are day two in Paris, and today, hopefully my camera is a little bit better of a spot. I went too far back yesterday. All right, this is a paper pad that I found cleaning, and I forgot I had it. Yeah, I do that a lot. Uh, it's a Paris kind of feel to me. Um, those are actually Florida leaves, and it doesn't, that pattern on there, it doesn't look like that in the picture, but it is. So, I have made a list of prompts. They're on my Instagram account. I put them there yesterday. Um, January 1st of 2019. That's going to be hard to say. Um, and anybody that wants to follow along can. This is mainly for Curti and I only because she's the one that watches my videos. Good morning, Curti. Enjoy your trip. I'm so jealous. Um, I... And those prompts are not written in stone. They can be suggestions. They can be ideas. They can be taken out of order. They can be whatever the user chooses. I have to have a little bit of a pathway so that I don't go all off kilter and end up in Argentina, which could happen. Um, and so I decided to make myself a prompt list. Hopefully, Curti, you like it. Uh, anything you want to do to it, you can. It's free for all. Um, and I like to make a calendar in my travel journals. It kind of gives me a path to stay on track while I journal what my trip is about. It also gives me a trip at a glance. Um, and I found this planner stencil in my stencil drawer, and I decided to make a calendar. Um, if you see that right there, that's not big enough. As I start to number, I realize I only have five days, and there are seven days when you're on vacation. I don't know. <laughs> and I'm like, it took me a minute. I'm like, well, you dingbat. Anyhow, there I'm studying the thing and da 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 da. I rectify it. I fix it. Um, I haven't filled in the calendar days as far as what day goes to each prompt yet. Uh, mainly because I made the prompt list after I did this. And I made the prompt list off camera. What I did was take a geography textbook that I've gotten at a thrift store and find the Paris page, make a light photocopy of it in color, and then printed my prompt list on vellum and put that over it. And again, you can see that on my um, Instagram page at four by eight paper stuff, all one thingy. Um, I try to remember to put stuff here in the description box, but I'm not very good at that part at all. I just like doing the fun stuff. So here I am rectifying my five day a week into a seven day a week for the whole month of January. The prompts, there's 31, and um, they're really obvious if you're in Paris, and that's what I'm gonna do for mine. Um, and so basically, yes, today is just me making a calendar page and struggling with how many days are in a week, and struggling to get the Florida leaves in the right direction on both pages, but it's mine. It's done. It's crazy. I'm crazy. It works for me. I'm still not in the right angle. I moved um, my desktop is a different desktop now, and I moved my camera, and I'm not technically savvy whatsoever, so I'm going to have to figure out my camera angle, which might take me a couple days, so I apologize, but I am what I am. I can't change me. And I, I mean, it's just for fun. It's just for fun. It's a way to use your prompts. It's a way, I mean, your supplies. It's a way to use your creativity and create every day, which to me is art therapy. And I have made it through 2018 doing art therapy every day. And I think that's the only thing that kept me sane. So I'm going to put my calendar page down. I've decided that this journal, which is my junk journal, is upside down. So I flip it around. Because I think, yeah, that little tiny journal card is one from the scrapbook paper. And I it says something like, let the daydream begin. And that's where I got the idea of Paris daydreams. So some of my pages are bigger than others. They're all different shapes. And I'm going to take that. I'm still going to do it in sequential order of how the pages show up in the book, but I am going to either remove elements. If I put elements down, they're all with washi tape so I can remove them. Um, but it's just going to be the page that I use that day. 
I think that's what I liked most about My Life Mitts December Daily. It was just random, and I really enjoy that. Um, yes, I love Jose Naranya. Yes, he is my all-time ultimate hero. Yes, he is very organized. But I go the, from two opposite ends of the spectrum, and that's me. This is a teeny tiny compact atlas, and I pulled out the Western Europe section and put on the other side of that flap. And I love it. Um, I may or may not put anything on top of it going down the road. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but it's an opportunity for me to put a map somewhere. And that's always a good thing. I have made some photocopies of some Louvre catalogs that are in French. Some Provence magazine. But it, it's still, I'm going to use it. It's all in French. I'm going to use it. And there will be popping up um, another French magazine and another Paris, another French, bleh, French map. So all of that stuff will show up eventually and come back tomorrow and see what we do in Paris. Uh, thanks for watching. I will, bonjour, bonjour.